State Championship weekend is so close you can almost smell it. Yeah, so let's tee this thing up and we will kick off another edition of Football Friday Night, the quarterfinal edition. We start with Sky Tracker hovering over the Show Me State Class 6 Rockhurst at Blue Spring South. We expected a nip and tuck game. That just didn't happen. The Jaguars took control early. Steven Sullivan with the touchdown run. Rocker struggling all night trying to get in the end zone. Nick Jones is picked off by Pat Martin in the end zone. The Hawklets reign atop class six is over. Blue Springs South wins at 28-7. They will play Francis Howell next week. Well, hopping the state line, we check out Kansas class 6A, Olathe East hosting Shawnee Mission West. And how about this for an opening drive for Olathe East? Junior Williams is in the open. He is blazing for the orange. Hawks up six to nothing. A Shawnee Mission West answers through the air. Armani Williams heaving it up to Joel Spiller. He hauls it in. That set up a field goal, but too few highlights and too few points for the Vikings. They fall to Olathe East, 46-16. to So the Hawks advancing to face the winner of this affair. Olathe South at Shawnee Mission East. The Falcons scoring early and often. Jordan Ward on the fullback down, and he has the first down and then some. Ward virtually untouched as he sprints into the end zone. The Shawnee Mission East trying to keep pace all all night long, Dakota Collins drops the biscuit and Connor Relahan's basket. Touchdown Lancers. They needed a few more of those, though. It'll be an all Olathe semifinal as South eliminates Shawnee Mission East 55 to 42. Arguably the two best teams in Kansas Class 5A clashing tonight. Blue Valley at Bishop Miege. The Stags believe that they would win, but Blue Valley is the defending state champs for a reason. First play from scrimmage. Kyle Zimmerman up top to a wide open Sean Skaggs. 7 0 Tigers. They have a very balanced attack this year. Justin Folks is just a Folks hero at Blue Valley. He scampers in for the score. Blue Valley scampers on to the semifinals 24 21. Next up, the Tigers will face another rival, Gardner Edgerton. The Trailblazers running a rough shot over Shawnee Heights here tonight. Trayvon Wrench wrenching it up again tonight. He crosses the goal line for a 6 0 Gardner Edgerton lead. The sophomore running back looks just as good from ground level as he does from the air. Wrench again, a touchdown again. The Trailblazers blazing on in the bracket. They knock off Shawnee Heights 32 0. The Skylights Tour also checking out the improbable playoff run of Blue Valley Southwest. They're visiting Paola in Kansas Class 4A. The Timberwolves having some trouble with Tyler Hennis. Here he is on the carry. Hennis, he takes the licking but keeps on ticking. Later on the same drive, Hennis, he's bouncing it outside. He makes a couple of defenders miss and then just drags a defender into the end zone. Paola moving on. They take out Blue Valley Southwest 35-21. The Panthers will have a rematch of their own with Eudora in the semifinals. The Cardinals showed Chanute the door tonight, 20 to 13. Eudora beat Paola 18 to 10 in Week 5. Well, we saw who won on the field, but who was the big winner in the stands here tonight? A High V Spirit Award goes to the school that best represents High V Sky Tracker and NBC Action News with signs and cheers. Tonight's winner is. Blue Springs South. The Jaguars win a $100 gift card from Hy-Vee. Hy-Vee, the official sponsor of High School Spirit.